guys welcome back to the channel I'm Megan Yvonne if you're new well, today's look is inspired by the season that we're about to enter into it's prom season we're getting ready to get all glam this is a ease like a transition into color because we have the color at the bottom it's not like boom in your face and you know it's going to give your look some pizzazz some fun it's gonna you know bring some life to your look so if you want to see how I got this stay tuned for the rest of the video so we are starting off with our transitional shade. It's a light brown shade and I am just going to put that all over my crease and above my crease and I'm slowly going to build that color up just so that it's easier for my other shades to uh, blend together. Then I'm going in with this darker brown. It's more or less like a cocoa color and I'm carving a slight V on the outer corner of my eye because I'm lending it for a cut crease. So that'll be coming up. Then I'm gonna use that original brush and create some you know softness because I don't want such harsh lines and harsh shadows so I'm blowing it out smoking it out a little bit then I'm going to add the shimmery shade this is where all the shimmer the glimmer comes in and I'm just taking my time and I'm slowly patting that on my lid just building up the intensity not really going in immediately with so much but slowly packing it on until it's giving the look that I desire so I am taking my time with that and then I'm just going to switch back and forth between each eye making sure that I'm carving out my crease the way I want it to look and now I'm going in with my liquid liner. For this particular look, I didn't want the liner at the top of my lash line to be the focal point because I was gonna put liner at the bottom. So I'm making my line really, really thin and I'm winging it out just a smidge, like just a little bit, not a lot, just a little bit. Um, I do want something for my lash line to conceal when I put on my actual lash but then I'm gonna go in and I'm going to use a little bit of a deeper brown mixed with a little bit of black and I'm just gonna smudge it out just a tad as well and this is just gonna give the look some dimension some shape and some depth then I'm going in with again that original brush and I'm just making sure to blend it out because I don't want harsh dark lines I want it everything to just like melt and mesh together so that it was beautiful and you know it you had the feeling of like I can't see where it begins can't see where it ends then I'm just gonna go ahead and coat my natural lashes with some mascara and then I'm gonna add my lash because you know we love a lash so there you see like I said I just wanted enough of a lash to um, enough of a liner to conceal my lash line then I'm going in with this beautiful uh, cold pencil and this is by Black Opal. They have really good cold pencils in that blue shade and it is so gorgeous. And I then want to take a little bit of a different type of shadow. Um, it's It was more like a mermaid type shadow because it had like some green specks in it. And I'm using that on the inner portion of my eye and just making sure to blend that in to the other shimmer color that I already had down on my lid. Now, it's important to set your liner. I wanted to make sure that the colors stay vibrant throughout the night, so I am setting it with a, a royal blue eyeshadow as well and then I'm taking a small liner brush and I'm just adding a little pop of shimmer up under my brow because after all it's a glamorous look thank you so much for staying tuned to the end of the video I really do appreciate it if you're new here go ahead and hit that subscribe button follow along with me for more like beauty videos lifestyle videos inspirational videos also, if you're new or you're returning, make sure you are hitting the like button. It really does help out my channel, helps push my videos out to more viewers. So go ahead and do that. Also, we are revving up for, you know, like beauty season. After prom season, we're gonna be jumping right into wedding season. So comment down below if there are some looks or some colors 
maybe some non-traditional colors that you want to see like how we can pull a look together for that i would love for you to um tell me what those are but thank you so much for tuning in i'll see you guys in my next one Mwah! bye